Hello, this is Kismet the Frog with Level Zero Ripoffs, the show where I speak in a horrible fake accent and teach you how to make games that already exist. We're doing this so that you can figure out the Unreal Engine to make your own games. One of the best ways to do this is to make a game, and we will make a game that already exists. So first we gotta get the Unreal Engine, pay no attention to that uh, thingy that I had in there already. We're gonna go to the website. Watch some lightsaber fighting, watch some card. just kidding, you're going to sign in. If you have not ever signed in before, you need to sign up. And you can sign up with any of these options. I'm going to show you the most complicated one, which is using your email at the top. The top, that's the one. Okay, so I'm going to go through this really fast. This is my own information that I'm going to blur out so you cannot see it. Once you fill out everything, you got to make sure you read the terms of service because they have rules for using the Unreal Engine. You got to know what the rules are, but it, you don't have to know everything. It's just it basically says don't sue us and um, be nice to people. It's the usual stuff. Don't be sneaky. Don't steal things, including intellectual property. Don't put the virus in the game, things like that. Don't do anything illegal. Check the box, says I'm not going to do anything illegal or nasty. Then you continue. Alright. Then it will send you a code in your email box that you put on the email thing. You sign up any of the other ways and it will uh, be easier, I think, because those are places that already know who you are. And the Epic Games says, I know who they are, they know you, who you are, so I'm okay with you. But anyway, you get the code from the email like I showed you, you put it in, you click the verify button, <coughs> wait for it to come back, and then you look at the top right corner, it'll see your name that you put in, and it will give you a download button on the right side. Just next to it. So you can log out if you want to, but I want you to stay logged in so you can click the download button. It's the blue one. Okay, right here you're going to have two choices. The one on the left says that I want to publish games or other things that I'm going to make money from. The one on the right side is more like uh, I'm just going to make stuff. Like uh, educational product or artwork, whatever. Uh, it's got more details, you can read about the rules in each one, but really doesn't matter until you make like a million dollars off of them because they don't start collecting their royalties from your products and games and things you make with Unreal Engine until you have made at least a million dollars. So at that point I don't think you have to worry about it. 5% is of a million dollars is a lot of money but it's only five dollars. It's only 5%. Of whatever it is you're making, so it's just at the top. But right now, today, this is level zero lesson. We are assuming you have no skills and that you do not even know what a game engine is. That you just want to make the games because you thought Unreal so cool because they make Fortnite. We are not making Fortnite today. We are going to make um, a really easy game, like one of the first games of in all history. We finally finished downloading after all of that and we're going to install it. Sometimes it takes a while to appear. You're going to get used to that using the engine when you try to open things. Then sometimes it disappears and then it doesn't come back for a few minutes. And then it says, oh yeah, I was working on that the whole time. <laughs> where were you? Um, yeah, so it's showing you where it's going to install it. It doesn't really let you change that. So click the button, but I'm not going to do it because I already have the engine. So you don't have to wait and watch me do that. So we're going to quit. Yeah, it's okay. Not was interrupted. I interrupted it on purpose. That's the end of that lesson. First lesson just shows you how to get the engine to your computer. And uh, next lesson we will start to use the engine.